Okay, there is some crazy stuff. This is a uh, second day in a row that I've seen the homeless talking to themselves and being just in general real trippy. But they're actually not talking to themselves. They're talking to someone else. And, uh, yeah, this other woman was actually making complete sense. Now, this guy, he's kind of just screaming and being trippy. He was talking earlier. But now, I can't hear what he's saying. Now he's growling. Uh, I actually believe these people are possessed. And I'm going to keep walking right now because I don't want this dude coming near me. It's, it is, it's pretty freaking scary. In fact, I have chills and I should probably just get out of here. But at the same time, it's kind of fascinating. In the power of Jesus, I command you to leave this guy alone. Leave now in the power of Jesus, I command you. Have him flee. The blood of Jesus Christ be over you. Flee. I command the presence within him, that man to flee right now by the power of Jesus Christ. Leave that man alone and flee. There he goes the other direction. I'm glad because, boy, my heart started to race there a little bit. It was a little crazy, and he's stopping again. I'm afraid to turn around to tell you the truth. I'm afraid when I do, he's going to flip out and come after me. But, uh, <clears throat> anyhow... Yeah, this is the second crazy person in two days that was really talking to themselves. I mean, gnarly tripping. And I, I seriously believe these people are possessed by evil spirits or something. Something is going on. Because these people are talking and they are, they're somewhat lucid. I mean, that guy is just tripping a little more. But there's, they, something's going on. And they're able to function. It's rather weird and then you get them they start growling and that's really weird and it kind of lets you know oh that's like some sort of weird entity going exerting power right there that's not just them on drugs or whatever that's some craziness happening